What's up guys? It's Anthony from Catalyst Fitness. Today I'm actually going to be going over uh, squats for weight loss and a couple different variations that you can do depending on your, uh, you know, your, your level and your capability. So the first one that I'm going to go over um, is something called a regression. Uh, so if you're going to be squatting, you want to make sure that you're doing it with proper form. So the e one of the easiest ways to do that is to use a weight in front of you as a counterbalance. Right here I have a 10 pound plate that I'm going to use as a counterbalance to make sure that my core is turned on and that my, back, my, bo uh, my body is staying upright. Um, because that's the biggest thing. If you know, your kinetic chain is off and your movement is off, it could cause injury. So the way I'm going to do this is I'm going to set up with my feet about shoulder width apart. From there, I want to make sure that my abs and my glutes are engaged. I'm going to start with, start with the plate tight to my chest. From there, I'm going to extend out, and then I'm going to drop down, driving my knees out, opening up my hips, all while keeping my abs tight. From there, I'm going to stand and squeeze the glutes. You're going to do about 8 to 12 reps of that. If that is too easy for you and you need a little bit more of a challenge, uh, we're actually going to do something called a goblet squat. So with that, what we'll do is we'll take a kettlebell that we're comfortable with. Again, everybody is at a different level, so I want you to choose something that you're comfortable with. It's better to start with something lighter, uh, just to be on the safe side. But here I have a 30-pound kettlebell. Again, I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to start with the kettlebell tight to my chest, feet shoulder width apart. Slight uh, extra rotation of the feet is OK, so that way we can open up our hips. So from there, it's the same movement. I'm going to drive my knees out, keep my chest tall, abs tight, squeeze the glutes even at the bottom, and then we stand and squeeze. I want you guys to try three or four sets of that of 8 to 12 reps, and let me know how your, how your body's feeling after that. Give it a shot. 